had to walk to get my water bottle and keys. <laughs> so the universe said no littering. Go get the water bottle and you can get your keys. <laughs> Good morning, friends. I am out in the park. I came out here to pick up a blessing. One of my neighbors um, had posted um, on a local site, um, the Next Door app, that she had some some garden truck bags um, that she wanted to give away for free. And she was like, you know, whoever needs them, um, you know, let me know, and we can. Anyway. After I picked up these garden bags that she gave me for free, um, I decided to come for a walk. But guys, let me just tell you the blessing, okay? I have my Timu cart and my Amazon carts full of these grow bags because I really want to get started on my fall um, gardening, which I hadn't done. And here we are in September, so I don't know how things are going to do. And I may just do a few things and hold off until the spring anything more but um she gave me three bundles okay they the packages are unopened and she's like i don't know how many are in there but they were in my storage and i just wanted to get rid of them and just clean it out so you know if you can use them great she said i don't know how many they are i tried to give her some money she would not take it um and so when i got in my car to look at the bundles i opened up just one of them and the bundle said that they were 20 gallon um grow bags i am just so blessed for that offering so she gave me three bundles of 10 so that's 30 20 gallon grow bags that's like that's that's just unbelievable and I just feel like that is such a blessing so anyway I am here at the park and I am about to start my walk and I just wanted to share a little bit of that with you guys um, this part will probably be taken out <laughs> but anyway I'm gonna go for my little walk here and the park is already um, Crowded. There are several walking groups out, and um, because it is the temperatures are much cooler, so Saturday, September 2nd, it is 63 and fair. It's supposed to get up to 82 today, and this is all Fahrenheit. So, just super excited that it feels great. However, I still have my water bottle, my towel, and I have my little neck fan on. Thanks, Miss Patty. And Miss Patty's kitchen um, gardening memoir, I think. I can't remember. <laughs> but anyway, I'm out here. I'm going to walk and enjoy and just count my blessings because you guys know that's what I do. I count my blessings even when I'm not feeling, you know, in a good mood um, or feeling. You know, at my best self, that's what you do. You stay grateful. You stay in your most grateful self and count your blessings. So, I'm gonna start my walk. Well, I've already started it, just very slowly. Good morning. Things all over the place. Trying to make sure I don't take any of it back home with me. So, look at the butterfly garden. It's just the United States is home to about 700 different kinds of butterflies. Wow, it's amazing. So this little area here is a year-round food and beauty that supplies 
butterflies, I guess moths and all kinds of insects, but primarily attracting butterflies. And it says the monarch butterflies can travel 50 to 100 miles a day on the migration from Canada and the US to Mexico. Wow, powerful little things. I had several in my garden lately. And then here, this one says hummingbirds need 6,000 to 12,000 calories per day and sip nectar that is 20 to 30% sugar. Soft drinks are about 10% sugar. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of sugar, little hummingbirds. But they don't have diabetes. Oh, anyway. Everything is so pretty out here. I'm gonna get down closer to the water, guys. You guys know I need the water in my life. So, so I'm gonna go down here to the water. And look, the area now has a shuttle service that operates from 12 to 6 p.m. I won't be out here at that time. The sun will be full peak, and I don't <laughs> enjoy the sun that much. I like the water. I love a sunrise and a sunset, but not the high noon sun. Look how still the waters are, guys. Look at these little cattails. Everything is blooming so pretty. Oh, those are pretty little flowers there. So pretty. Very lovely. Cruise ducks and swans <laughs> and dragons. <laughs> there are a couple of real geese over there. I'll have to take little breaks. Not sure how far I can go. I'll do the whole little, you know, mile and a half. But my back is already feeling a little something here. You guys see the, the geese there? I do apologize if I'm shaky today, but I guess that's what happens when I get a little pain. I get a little shaky. And even though I'm hot, I'm not. I don't feel heated, so I haven't even had to turn my fan on yet. <laughs> this is so cool. I'll keep walking. I just walk through some bugs. I hope none of them got in my mouth. Okay. Sorry, that was a little fast whipping about that I did there. This week was a, a busy week uh, for me. Excuse me. Um, with work and home too. Lots of things going on. Lots of things trying to, you know, steal my peace, <laughs> steal my joy. But I won't let it. Um, I think. Before I try to tackle this hill, that I am going to need to take a small rest break. Um, and I'm not even sure 
if I'll be able to do this today because mm, I'm gonna sit here on this bench here. Ooh. I wish there was a way to like mute the video um, when there was unwanted sound around instead of having to stop and start over. And I'm sure that that is possible on real cameras versus my little cell phone video here. group of men there I'm quite loud <laughs> and that part of the walk up there and through the trees is my favorite part but um I'm not sure if I'm gonna make it today oh, I'm gonna try though so you guys just bear with me I'm having a moment here hmm. Okay, friends, as you can see, I did not make it up around the park. So I rested a little bit and with what energy I have left today, <laughs> or rather this morning, I am um, going to retrace my steps and head out of the park and go home. had pain meds um, to take after my walk because I knew I was going to probably need it, but I guess I should have taken it before <laughs> my walk, so I'm going to go ahead and there's a little ducks and I hope I didn't step in anything. Hello, fellas. I think that's a mom and some teens. Or dad, he looks like he's watching. But anyway, I'm retracing my steps and heading back home because I did not quite enjoy the walk itself. The views, yes, but not the walking, which is not good. So, Good morning. Good morning. So, I am going to head back up and out of the park. I don't quite like feeling like this. It's so beautiful is there. Lovely yellow. Or actually, I don't know what type of plants these are. I'm always trying to name something. I'm not quite doing the best for those. Oh, sorry. For this little ramp here, that'll make it a little easier to get back to my car. I just love 
this little space here for the butterflies. Well, friends, I am not feeling my best self today. means that I probably won't get any of my normal Saturday activities done. You know, like grocery shopping and cooking and cleaning because I am pretty much overexerting myself. Whew. And here I am another rest <sighs> excuse my fan noise but the pain kind of heats me up <sighs> she's a little pollinator friend you guys see him there? <laughs> Isn't that pretty? Busy bees. I just realized I left my water bottle on that bench down there. And unfortunately, I can't be a good citizen and go back to get it. <laughs> oh no. I could drive back around to the other side to go and get it. Oh, I hate that I left that there. I did not do it intentionally. Hmm. Okay. Well, thank you guys for hanging out with me. And maybe we can come back another day and have a better walk. I didn't record the whole thing because I didn't want you to hear all of my huffing and puffing, but I had to come back to this bench because guess what? With the water bottle was also my car keys. <laughs> so I had to walk from all the way there you see the red area yeah. to back here to get my water bottle and keys <laughs> so the universe said no littering go get the water bottle and you can get your keys be good to everyone be good to the earth <laughs> else you will suffer <laughs> because I am truly suffering. And I got the water bottle and my keys now, folks. No more water for me today. I mean, lake water. So I probably need to rest before I try to tackle this again, but I'm just gonna go and suffer. Okay, signing off one more time, guys. Stay blessed and beautiful. Mm and be good to yourselves and to the people and to this great earth of ours. <laughs>